We begin the installation by protecting the perimeter of the integrated center stack with painter's tape. Use a non-marring pry tool to remove the integrated center stack. A wide pry tool works best to spread the pressure. Locate the security gateway module. For better access, remove the three 7mm screws holding the module. Next, disconnect the 8 position connector from the security gateway module. Be sure to hold the latch on the connector before attempting the disconnect. If the connector is stuck, use a small flat screwdriver to assist with the removal. Connect the vehicle harness to the auto stop eliminator, then connect the auto stop eliminator to the security gateway module. Tuck the device harness in the area below the gateway module, then reinstall the three 7mm screws. Use a zip tie to fasten the auto stop eliminator module in front of the security gateway module as shown. Bending the zip tie into a U shape may help with the routing of the tie. It may also be helpful to connect the ends of the zip tie prior to positioning the auto stop eliminator module. Trim the excess from the zip tie. Remove the painter's tape, then reinstall the integrated center stack. Removing the tape first makes the tape removal easier than the order shown here. Now that the device is installed, we'll start the vehicle and ensure auto start stop is off. Once auto start stop is turned off, the device will remember and automatically restore the off setting. After restarting, we can see the off setting was automatically restored. Next, we'll turn auto start stop back on to show that this setting is also maintained. We'll set auto start stop to off and restart one last time. It's that easy to keep auto start stop disabled on your Chrysler Pacifica.